Via Venture started back in 2001. Well, we didn't have any clue about what we were doing. No clue what we were doing, really. We drove down from Los Angeles with four kayaks strapped to the top of my mom's ranch truck. We spent about a year traveling around Guatemala, getting to know the place. And we just started contacting companies. Local operators, the tour guides, and the hotels in each place. Our attention was always on the quality of service. We needed some kind of a multi-sport angle to what we did. One day I met James. Six months later, we decided it was a good match to partner up. Partnered up with Beat. He had a small tour company, operating mountain bike tours here since 1993. That was via venture, so it was me, James and Biat from the very early days. I used to drive the tours myself and we basically just bootstrapped the company from nothing. It's just grown in so many different ways. It was a small group of people and we have this huge office and... An extensive network of freelance guides and drivers. Moving six to seven thousand people a year. All throughout Central America. Bioventure people are fun. We recognize that people spend a lot of time at work. Eight hours of their day is there in the office, so we've tried to make it cool with some chill out spaces, got a climbing wall in the backyard. Our office space is where we just pretend to work, really. We just go and have fun every day. The away day are always really fun things. We just get to have some downtime and learn more about each other and grow as a team. You know, we just want to make it very much like a family vibe. I just feel so comfortable every day when I get up and go to work because I'm with people who know me and people who care. We all come to work because we just love what we do. That's such a special, unique thing and we're lucky to have so much of it. We realize that people are everything. Probably most importantly, the, the actual guides and the drivers and the people that have contact with our guests out in the field. We want them to greet our clients in a way that they're greeting an extended family member. You know, like a friend has just arrived. We had to make sure our guests have the best experience and also to keep them safe and sound. Every year, Via Venture does this partner training. Focus in guides and transportation suppliers. We receive lectures, experts in Maya archaeology or social programs or nature. We try to prove ourselves and provide the best to our clients. We have like a team building activities, <laughs> a lot of them. It's the only company that provides you this to explore your own initiatives. We really put a lot of attention and effort on getting the best people and trying to improve that every year because we recognize that they are the face of the company. And I think that's a cool thing I like from the company, to be myself, to be myself. The only way to really get all the details and knowledge that you need in order to put together a tour, you have to do it. You have to know every hotel, all the different rooms, all the tours, all the guides, all the drivers. It's a very difficult and quite stressful job. And I think what's amazing about the team is that they know all that and they deal with that every day. But it's great fun because you actually do go out and you figure those things out in the field. It's kind of awesome. I get to do what our clients do, but I get paid for it. Every tour that we do is customized and tailor-made to fit each client's interest. I think we're, we're a pretty unique company in that our clientele ranges from backpackers to billionaires. We have clients that are on very basic tours where they only request basic services from us. And then everything on up to the very best in private luxury services. The really cool thing is the commonality of the experience. It doesn't matter what kind of level of luxury that you've chosen to travel here with, you're gonna be interacting with the same locals, the same people, you're gonna be visiting the same places. And I feel like today if anyone, anyone came to us, no matter what they're looking for, we can, we can make it happen for them. If you get to understand the person and know what they like and they share about themselves with you, you can plan something that's special to them. You know, give our guests a chance to maybe see and discover things that are a bit off the touristy path. They wouldn't have done that if they just picked up the Lonely Planet and read, oh, we should go here. They go away having had the time of their life and the experience of their life. You read the feedback from them and they're writing in bold and capital letters and everything. And you just have this sense of connection with a person that we were able to make that happen. That is really rewarding. They've come to us and said, wow, this was the most amazing trip. That's a really nice feedback to get. 
People won't remember what you did or what you said, they remember how you made them feel. It makes us feel like we've done something right.